out and uh, when they are rolling out this um uh, that policy but shall we should go to the various agencies of government in their libraries and the shelves you will see several policies gathering dust i'll be more worried if INEC will promise the nation that they will do within the best of the ability and the availability of resources ensure that all they have done all they have stated they will do but i'm worried about some things for instance they said uh, face masks will be provided only to election officials in the village in the rural areas and so on and you want people to come out if you really want people we, we have been complaining about voter party people are not coming to police station maybe this would have been an opportunity to incentivize coming out to vote i have looked at the percentage of voter turnout in 2016, the last time governorship election took place in these states, in Edo, we were, it was about 55,000, no, 550,000 something, in Ondo, 230 something thousand. Today, a first mass, cloth first mass is about 100 naira. Can I make, ask for funds to provide first mass for every voter? Secondly, they said hand sanitizers will be provided. Uh, there will be provision for disinfecting the pooling units, the infrastructure, perhaps furniture they will use and so on. I am worried. Why am I worried? Provision of these services may be uh, done through con the contract system. We are nobody supervises anybody given a job in this country. So, would the appropriate strength of the chemical be used? Who supply the hand sanitizers? Will there be somebody to guarantee that they have the correct, appropriate um, strength of alcohol? People use, their, in the market today, you see all sorts of chemicals people have uh, produced and called hand sanitizers, and these cannot sanitize anything. So, INEC, thank you for the policy, but implementation is key.